गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू द ऑनलाइन क्लास एज यू नो यस्टरडे वी हैव फिनिश्ड दिस चैप्टर वॉट लूसी फाउंड देयर एज वी हैव सीन लूसी वॉज क्वाइट लाइक क्यूरियस गर्ल शी वॉन्टेड टू नो शी वॉन्टेड टू लर्न शी वॉन्टेड टू एक्सप्लोर थिंग्स बाय हर ओन एंड वॉन्टेड टू सी द थिंग्स अराउंड हर वन डे वॉट हैपन शी गॉट इन टू एन इनॉर्मस uh what dropped where she reached to the place which called narnia right and there she saw a different kind of creature that was a fawn right and the fawn name was tumnus right there she talked with him and uh, the uh, fawn tumnus uh invited her to have some tea have some breakfast have some food with her right what happened there uh, when she when he saw lucy he asked that whether she is the daughter of adam or eve right but she said no i'm not daughter of uh, uh, eve adam or eve i'm a girl right and he asked that are you a human then she said what yes i'm a girl i'm a human and he said that come let's have some tea because it will remain here in the open space will get cold and then she holded her arm and they were walking just like they met each other before they know each other from a very long time this was the thing she came when she entered into the cave where this uh, found the tumnus lived she found very strange and a very different thing around the places she looked everywhere and she found that there is a room which leads to tumnus room bedroom and she saw many books which was uh, placed over the mantel piece it named different the book's name were different like uh, life and letters of selenius or nymphs and their ways or men monks and game keepers a study in popular legend or is a man a myth these were the things the titles have to the books right yesterday we have finished up to here now we'll continue now daughter of eve said the fawn and really it was a wonderful tea there was a nice brown egg lightly boiled for each of them and then sardines on toast and then buttered toast and then toast with honey and then a sugar topped cake this were the things was presented by the fawn to lucy and when lucy was tired of eating the fawn began to talk yes when she was having this kind of food which was presented which was given by uh, this fawn to lucy she got tired of eating and afterwards what happened fawn began to talk he had wonderful tales to tell of life in the forest means he had so many things so many stories to share with lucy he told about the midnight dances and how the nymphs who lived in the wells and the dryads what is this dryads a female spirit who lives in a tree spirit you know like a ghost and all they live on tree who lived in the trees came out to dance with the fawn yes many he is uh, he is sharing a story where the fawn and dryads and nymphs were dancing together one night about long hunting parties after the milk white stag who could give you wishes if you caught him he also said about the story where they were doing parties uh, when they met with the white reindeer or a white uh, uh, like a white milk ek, ekdam uske uh, like very clear deer 
right and when you will uh, like uh, stop them when you will uh, caught them they will give you wishes after feasting and treasure shaking the wild red dwarfs in deep mines and caverns caverns far beneath the forest floor and now he saying that after this all the things we could also find what we could also see the red dwarf like chote bonny logo ka khazana treasures and all and then about summer when the woods were green and old linnaeus on his fat donkey would come to visit them and sometime bacchus himself and then streams would run with wine instead of water and whole forest give itself up to a jollification for weeks on end so he also said that how in summer woods uh, like uh, they uh, were green like now in winter it is really brown but in summer the woods were green like forest were green and also we can see like uh, uh, the water it converted into wine okay the like the stream would run with the wine not with the water the whole forest would give itself to a jollification for weeks on end so bahut din tak ye forest could enjoy could uh, like uh, could not end up there jolly things like they were so happy at the time so this way the thing he shared the stories tales what he had and he shared this all the things to the girl lucy not that is isn't always winter now he added gloomily and now what he said that now it isn't like jaise pehle hota tha ab waisa kuch bhi nahi hota hai then to cheer himself up he took out from its case on dresser a strange little flute that looked as if it made of straw and began to play when he got sad he took a little uh, he took a like a flute thing and he started to uh, play that and the tune he played made lucy want to cry and laugh and dance and go to sleep all at the same time when she heard this type of tune tune she like wanted to cry she wanted to laugh she wanted to dance all at the same time also wanted to sleep it must have been hours later when she shook herself and said now it got too late where she reached there right it got too late and now she wanted to get back to her own place oh Mr. Tumnus, I'm so sorry to stop you, and I do love that tune. But really, I must go home. I only meant to stay for a few minutes. Like I only wanted to stay here for a few minutes, but it got up to an hour, and now I have to get back to my own place. It is no good now, you know," said the fawn. laying down its flute and shaking his head at her very sorrowfully like he got very sad after listening this that the girl wanted to get back to her own place and uh, he got sad and he started to like uh, he was so sad no good said lucy jumping up and feeling rather frightened now she got frightened like this uh, fawn just uh, before the time he said that uh, you can get back after having tea and all but now he's saying no it's not good what do you mean i have to go home at once the others will be wondering what has happened to me i have to get back to my home otherwise the person who is living with me the family will worry about me that where i am but a moment later she asked mr tumnus whatever is the matter for the fawn's brown eye had filled with tears and then the tears began trickling down its cheeks and soon they were running off the end of its nose and at last it covered its face with its hand and began to howl now what happened before she will ask that whatever the matter the fawn started to cry he was so low 
वो लाइक रोते रोते लाइक ज़ोर ज़ोर से वो आवाज़ करके रोने लगा फर्स्ट उनके आंखों से आंसू गिरने लगे ब्राउन आई से एंड देन ही स्टार्टेड टू हाउल हाउल में ज़ोर से चिल्ला कर रोना एंड ही कवर्ड हिज फेस विथ हिज हैंड मिस्टर टामनस मिस्टर टामनस सेट लूस इन ग्रेट डिस्ट्रस डोंट डोंट वॉट इज द मैटर आंट यू वेल डी अ मिस्टर टामनस डू टेल मी वॉट इज रॉन्ग बट द फोन कंटिन्यू सो बिंग एज इफ इट्स हर्ड वुड ब्रेक लाइक नाउ दस मिस्टर टामनस गॉड ब्रेक हिज हर्ड दैट शी सेड दैट ही शी हैड टू गेट बैक टू द प्लेस ओके But now she asking, "What is the wrong?" I said, "Mr. Tumnus, are you okay or not?" And even when Lucy went over and put her arm around him and lent him her handkerchief, he said he didn't stop. He merely looked, took the handkerchief, and kept on using it, wringing it out with both hands whenever it go to the bed. be any more use so that presently lucy was standing in a damp patch now she was really confused she was really confused that what is the matter why this fawn is crying and when she gave her him handkerchief he cleared the face and he uh, like um, cow his arms around him and uh, like uh, he was just uh, cleaning all the uh, tears from her uh, from his Uh, faces, Mister Tumnus bowed loosely in his ear, shaking him. Now, Mister Tum, like जब वो नीचे टेबल पे लेटा हुआ था, अपने फेस को कवर करके लूसी उसके हाथ को टच करते हुए जोर से उसके कान में बोल रही है, Mister Tumnus, है ना? Do stop, please stop crying. Stop it at once. You ought be ashamed of yourself. A great big found like you. What on earth are you crying about? What happened to you? Ah, please, but tell me why you are crying. Oh, oh, so Mr. Tumnus, I'm crying because I'm such a bad fawn. Okay, now he started to tell why he is crying. He said what? He said I am a bad fawn. I don't think you are a bad fawn at all," said Lucy. I think you are a very good fawn. You are the nicest fawn I have ever met. Oh, you wouldn't say that if you knew," replied Mister Tumnus. Okay, now uh, if you will know about me, you're gonna hate me. You're gonna uh, like you're gonna uh, think that I'm really bad. If you will know whole story about me, and again he started to sob. शिक्षक शिक्षक के रोने लग नो आई एम अ बैड फोन आई डोंट सपोज देर एवर वॉज अ वर्स फोन सिंस द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द वर्ल्ड ये वर्ल्ड शुरू होने के पहले मुझे नहीं लगता कि उससे पहले कोई खराब फोन हुआ होगा जितना कि मैं खराब फोन हूँ बट वॉट हैव यू डन आस्क लूसी नो टेल मी वॉट हैपन अभी तक तो बहुत अच्छे से यू वर टॉकिंग जस्ट बिकॉज आई सेट दैट आई हैव टू रिटर्न बैक टू द होम ना वॉट वॉट वॉज दैट वॉट मेड यू टू क्राई लाइक दैट वॉट यू हैव डन माई ओल्ड फादर ना सेट मिस्टर टमनस दैट्स हिज पिक्चर ओवर द मैंटल पीस He would never have done a thing like this. Okay, now he's saying that मैं मैंने जो किया वैसा काम कभी वो नहीं करते. A thing like what? Said Lucy. Like what I have done. Said the phone. Taken service under the White Witch. That's what I am. I am in the pay of White Witch. Now I'm. Servicing, I'm doing work for White Witch, okay. That is my biggest mistake, and I think मैंने जो किया वो मेरे फादर कभी नहीं करते. The White Witch, who is she? Why is it? It is she that has got all Narnia under her thumb. It's she take she that makes it always winter. Always winter and never Christmas. Think of that. Now 
he asked he added about that winter uh, like white witch that she always wanted winter and she don't allow christmas also think about that we never have christmas we have only winter how awful said lucy but what does she pay you for aapko wo kyu pay karti why you are doing work for her why what she gave instead of that work whenever we are working something for uh, like uh, uske badle mein hame kuch milta hai like payments and all or whatever the appreciation we get so what are the thing what, if you are working for her what you get back from her that's the worst of it said mr tumnus with a deep groan now uh, like uh, or bhi bahut zyada like uh, dukhi man se he is saying this all the things i'm a kidnapper for her that's what i am look at me daughter of eve we believe that i am the shot of fawn to meet a poor innocent child in the wood one that had never done me any harm and pretended to be friendly with it and invite it home to my cave all for the sake of luling it asleep and then handing it over to the white witch are you आम अ किडनेपर मैं क्या हूँ ए किडनेपर एंड थिंक उन्होंने मुझे बोला है दैट वेन एवर यू विल फाइंड अ ह्यूमन चाइल्ड यू हैव टू ब्रिंग द यू हैव टू किडनेप इट एंड यू हैव टू ब्रॉड मी राइट सो दिस इज द थिंग आई एम डूइंग फॉर हर एंड यू थिंक तुम अभी आई हो एक इनसेंट चाइल्ड जो मेरे साथ मुझे कुछ हार्म भी नहीं कि मुझे मुझसे अच्छे से बात कर रही है शी इज़ ट्राइंग टू बी काइंड विथ मी थिंक वॉट मैंने उसे अपने घर पे लाया फॉर टी एंड ऑल एंड आफ्टर दिस ऑल वो मुझे चुप करा रही है और मैं उसी बच्चे को उस वाइट बीच के वाइट बीच को दे दूँ नो सेड लूसी आई एम श्योर यू वन डू एनी थिंग ऑफ दैट शॉर्ट मुझे पता है कि आप ऐसा कुछ भी नहीं करोगे आप मुझे कभी भी उस वाइट बीच को नहीं दोगे एज इट इज योर वर्क बट मुझे पता है कि आप ऐसा नहीं करोगे एंड दैट इज द थिंग दैट्स वाई ही वॉज क्राइंग बट आई हैव सेट द फोन ना फोन इज सींग दैट आई हैव टू well said lucy rather slowly well that was pretty bad but you are sorry for it that i'm sure you will never do it again okay mujhe pata hai ki aapko bura lag raha hai and you you are not going to do that but aapko us baat ke liye regret hai pachhtaava hai that you would do anything bad right to uh, why you are crying now daughter of eve don't you understand said the fawn it isn't something i have done i am doing it now this very moment main abhi karne wala hu what do you mean cried lucy turning very white now lucy was really like uh, confused ki what he is trying to say what he is going to do now with me you are the child said tumnus i had orders from the white witch that if i ever saw a son of adam or a daughter of eve in the wood i was to catch them and hand them over to her and you are the first i have ever met uh, and i have pretended to be your friend and asked you to tea and all the time i have been meaning to wait till you were asleep and then go and tell her राइट right? मैं ये तो सोच रहा था कि तुम्हें अपने केव में लाकर कर वैन यू विल स्लीप हीयर मैं जाकर वाइट बीच को इन्फॉर्म करूँगा दैट आई गॉड द ह्यूमन एडम एंड ईव सन और डॉटर राइट एंड मैं उसे जाके बताऊँगा ओ पर यू वॉन्ट मिस्टर टमनस सेट लूसी यू वॉन्ट विल यू इंडीड इंडीड यू रियली मस्ट एंड नाव शी इज सेंग दैट प्लीज प्लीज ऐसा कुछ भी मत करना ऐसा आप करने जा रहे हो सच में नो नो प्लीज डोंट डू दिस एंड इफ आई डोंट शी सेट ही बिगनिंग टू क्राई अगेन शी इज श्योर टू फाइंड आउट एंड शी विल हैव माई टेल कट ऑफ एंड माई हॉर्नस शॉन ऑफ एंड माई बियर्ड प्लग आउट एंड शी विल वेव हो वैंड ओवर माई ब्यूटिफुल क्लोव हूस एंड टर्न दैम इन टू हॉर्ड सॉलिड हूस लाइक रेचड horses now what she will do after knowing this all the thing that i let you go she will punish me she will punish me she will 
कट माई ऑल हेयर्स बियर्ड एंड ऑल सब कुछ छोटा कर देगी एंड विल वो जो हॉर्स का जो भी है वो मुझसे छीन लेगी है ना वो मुझसे छीन लेगी एंड इफ शी इज एक्स्ट्रा एंड स्पेशली एंग्री शी विल टर्न मी इन टू स्टोन एंड आई शैल बी ओनली स्टैचू ऑफ अ फोन इन हॉरिबल हाउस अनटिल द फोर थ्रोन्स एट केयर पेरवल्स आर फिल्ड एंड गुडनेस नो वॉट दैट will happen or whether it will happen at all. Now she he said that अगर वो ज़्यादा गुस्सा हुई तो मुझे एक स्टोन बना देगी उस हॉरिबल हाउस में अपने घर के अंदर एंड मुझे नहीं पता वॉट एवर थिंग्स इज गोइंग टू बी हैपन विथ मी आई एम वेरी सॉरी मिस्टर टॉमनर्स सेड लूसी बट प्लीज लेट मी गो होम ऑफ कोर्स आई विल सेट द फोन Of course I have to go. I see that now. I hadn't know what humans were like before I met you. Of course I can't give you up to the witch. Not now that I know you, but we must be off at once. I'll see you back to the lamp post. I suppose you can find your own way back there to spare room and wardrobe. I'm sure I can," said Lucy. Now ही सर नो नो मैं कभी ऐसा नहीं करूँ मैंने पहली बार किसी ह्यूमन के बच्चे से बात की एंड एंड शी इज़ सो स्वीट दैट आई कॉन्ट हैंड ओवर यू टू द वाइट विच नाउ आई सजेस्ट यू दैट वी शुड लीव दिस प्लेस एंड यू शुड बी बैक टू योर ओन प्लेस वॉट शो जहाँ से आप आई हो एंड यू शुड बी बैक एंड आई सपोज यू विल फाइंड योर ओन वे राइट एंड दे ही लेफ्ट लूसी एंड Lucy get back to the wardrobe and she left Narnia. So this chapter is from an extract. It is a novel. Okay, ये novel है उसमें से एक एक chapter उठा कर दिया हुआ है that what Lucy found there when she get into the wardrobe and whom she met and what she what she know what story was shared by that fawn. Okay, so. Now also you just read this all the chapter and find out the word meaning which are new to you. Try to understand the chapter and if you have any problem, then uh, watch this video again. Tomorrow I'll come with the summary and the exercise part of this chapter. Okay, so guys, till then please watch the video, read the uh, chapter by your own and find out the word meanings. Okay, so have a nice day to all and bye everyone.